living on a farm is never ending projects one after another so another project wasn't expecting but I have a hydrant water line coming from the house this way and electric line coming this way up to this hydrant this hydrant is about four years old and um, one day a couple of days ago water quit running out of that uh, uh, the hydrant the same line has a T over there by the house by the garage to the gar garden there's another hydrant uh, out there it works that one works has water but the pressure is kind of low so I figured something's wrong with this one so I started digging of course I never thought I'm gonna have to do this I got rock river rock I got um, a little protection um, uh, fabric and then I had uh, two inches of uh, foam insulation around this pipe and I did it really well never thought I'm gonna have to open it but you can see it's all wet and I just shut the water off and it was the water was coming out of that rock and of course water comes up on the least resistance right there puddles and I'm like why it's like been hot and we didn't have rain for like weeks and why is the water standing over there you know what I mean so it seeps out of the ground and uh, we're on the well system so it just constantly constantly so my first uh, clue was when this is was covered I'm like why the water is not going in I was able to rotate this thing very easily well that that gave me a clue saying well that's not supposed to be because there is a elbow up there to a pipe that's not gonna supposed to rotate that easy I thought I knew there's something on the bottom that's messed up and yeah so I'm gonna dig it up there's about two feet of rock and I try to get to it see what happens I'm gonna share with you guys the issue that you might have similar situation I don't know what caused it we'll figure it out a backhoe hooked up to a three-point hitch yep so that's uh, my little project that I wasn't expecting kind of emergency project I need this is where I give water to my cows so so there we go there's the pipe it's 5 8 packs uh, coming out of the house that's where it connects I put some tape in here this is where it drains this is where the problem is right on top of that look at that look at that it's rusted and broke I say it's a crappy design cheap manufacture defect because it's rusted out it's pretty thin up here I'm gonna dig it up and see I give you a better image of that it's right there is the issue it broke totally like rusted out yeah I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this brand again here I'm gonna probably go buy a different brand and put it up here I'm not gonna and what I'll do is I'll extend this uh, drain hole a little pipe I'm gonna extend it out further up here somewhere you know so it drains a little further from the rock i mean from the connection but yeah anyways this is uh clear water i think brand made in of obvious if i saw that i would not buy it and it was the manufacturer clear water i think is the manufacturer of this i got picked this up at menards yeah oh clear source clear source very not clear very disappointing all right so i pulled it off and this looks really good here this is my creation it's beautiful nothing wrong with it down here i got stainless steel clamps that the clamp the packs pipe to the fitting so that's good I'm not gonna even open it up this is where the issue is right here look at that it's uh it's cast iron 
but for some reason it snapped like nobody's business. I think it's cast iron. Right? No, it looks like copper to me. Anyways, it's it broke right here, real thin metal here, and it broke. Just came back from the store. Actually, I been to two stores, Baumgard and Menard. So Menards does carry um, wood Ford. They were in business since 19, I think 29 or something like that. It's uh, from Iowa company from Iowa. Um, Iowa frost proof. This one, I believe it's, um, look at this, this end, how strong that is much more beefier than um, the other side so this one's um, 139 dollars I mean it's pricey is double the price what this one was this one that broke it's double the price so don't go cheap and made in USA especially in Iowa nice love it and it has a little stop in here too that you can lock so kids don't pop it open and I went to the other store Baumgard and um, got this one that's also made in USA. I haven't opened up the casing of it, but um, let's see what that looks like. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Mr. Mm. Bull's coming to drink water. Of course, there's no water. Sorry, guy. All right, this is what it looks like. It looks pretty mm. neat. Not too bad. <laughs> and also, what I did, I got myself one of these pieces with like two feet. This gonna, I'm gonna attach it to the end of this. As you can tell, look at this one. It's much better made than the garbage one that broke because it cracked like right here somewhere. Much more stronger. Mm. So I will be installing probably the red one here i have another um hydrant that i want to do on the other side of the um, property so anyways i'm gonna get this done hopefully yeah, today hello mister you're not happy because you're not there's no water right yeah i know no he's not happy he's not happy mr bull is not happy are you happy oh faith is happy She's a good girl. She just got her shots yesterday, right? Rabies shots. She's good. All right, so I gotta get to work. It's getting dark. Looky, looky here. I like when everything goes by the plan. Look at that water working beautifully. Now the bull's gonna be happy. I wanna see what's up. Make sure it's not leaking nothing here. Looking good, looking good. I'm not seeing no leaks. I use some of this stuff. Pro dope. Some of this dope. And uh, yeah, working beautifully. Made in Iowa. By Iowan, actually, yeah. Something like that. So there we go. Don't go cheap on a hydrant because you don't want to be digging what I did. And I'm going to put some um, insulation on it. Actually, yeah, I'm going to put the rock back on. Um, and then uh, some fabric and insulation on it uh, just in case so it doesn't freeze anything up. I never had issue uh, in, at all. Any throughout winters never had issue it's been like four to five years so it has to be a little deeper than that but the pipe coming in is little is at that level so the hydrant is at that level too i could have pushed it down more but was that was the point well, i might put some more dirt up here so it's frost level is 42 inches so it's good like it should